Can you imagine HDTV's property brothers working right here in our neck of the woods? Well, they aren't, but a local realtor is offering buyers the exact same opportunity right here in Sacramento. That realtor is Terrence Springer with Remax Gold. And I had a chance to sit down and talk with him about his new program. Let's take a look. When I first heard this program that you put together, I was fired up. Yeah, one of the options that we needed to come up with is how to help people buy homes at a discounted value put a little bit of sweat equity into it, and then be able to actually enjoy the equity that they've now achieved through that sweat equity. I think it's pretty awesome. I think there's some different things that we can offer that new buyer, that first time buyer, that really wants that great house, but doesn't have the budget for it just yet. So can you imagine, have you been through any houses where you look at them and you go, man, I love this neighborhood, but this house, I just can't even see myself living there. I mean, tell us some of the things that you've seen as far as some of the crummy looking houses that could... Wow, there are true fixer-uppers. If you enjoy the smell of cat urine, <laughs> dog feces, how about hoarding 101, 17 dumpsters to get the house cleared so you wow. can actually see it? That would be an interesting type of experience. This right. is what we've come across. Sure, and so what happens when you find one of those properties? Well, what I do is I look at what the value is today and what it could be with a little bit of hard work on it. So what I'm looking for is good bones, a great location. The golden rule you've heard over and over and over again is location, location, location. That's the only thing I'm concerned about. What a great opportunity for buyers that want to buy in an established neighborhood, get exactly what they want, fix up a, maybe a crappy property that could be really cool and even save a lot of money in the process of doing it. For the full interview, please go to the Iron Point Mortgage YouTube page and check it out. Now for our new listing highlight this week with Karen Catania with Lion Realty in Cameron Park. Hi, I'm Karen Catania with Lion Real Estate. I'm here at my new listing on Kimberly Road in Cameron Park. This is an amazing single story home. It's got three bedrooms plus an office. The kitchen's got everything you'd expect with granite counters and a beautiful view. It's got a great backyard with room for the kids to play or just to simply entertain friends. It's got a three car garage, all right here located near Cameron Park's award winning schools. Give me a call if you'd like to check it out. Again, I'm Karen Catania with Lion Real Estate. Thank you. Great home, Karen. Be sure to give her a call if you've got any questions on the property or one of your buyers is interested. And now for minding your own business. LinkedIn may look and feel a lot like Facebook, but with its 300 million users, it really stands out as the top professional networking site out there. And guess what? Your clients are those professionals on the site. So connecting through LinkedIn is really a must. To start with, post a recent professional face forward profile picture. Second, create a professional headline. Third, make sure you complete all the available profile fields in your setup and answer every question. Each one will link you to more connections and get you more connections. Fourth, make your contact information available and make sure it's correct. Fifth, write a really good compelling summary with details and rich keywords for your industry. And lastly, connect with people. Definitely connect. When people connect with you, definitely take a moment to thank them for connecting. Get real and network with them. We're gonna be discussing LinkedIn more in future segments, but if you haven't set up a professional profile yet, take the time to do it, you'll be happy you did. Next time, we're gonna talk more about posting and exactly what to post on LinkedIn. That's it for this week's edition of the Real Estate Insider Weekly. Thanks for your feedback. Keep the comments coming. We really enjoy connecting with you and have a great week.